Dear students, today topic is all about degree of carbon. So, there are four types of degree about the carbon and they are primary, secondary, tertiary and quaternary. So, we can call it primary means 1 degree carbon, secondary means 2 degree carbon, tertiary means 3 degree and quaternary means 4 degree carbon. So, in this way, we have four different varieties of the carbon. Okay. Now, how to know that this particular carbon is 1 degree carbon or 4 degree carbon or 3 degree carbon? How to identify the degree of any particular carbon? So, dear student, let us see few examples. If suppose I write CH3, CH3. Okay. So, in CH3, CH3, I want to know the degree of this carbon. So, how to know? It is very simple dear student. Tell me, with this carbon, how many carbon connected? I mean, how many carbon is touching this carbon? Tell me, only one carbon, this carbon is touching this carbon. So, this particular carbon is 1 degree carbon or primary carbon. It is very simple. Okay. Let us see more example, no problem. Suppose, I am writing here, CH, CH3, CH3. It is better to write CH2. Okay. Now, CH2 and here CH3, CH3. Tell me, if I ask about this carbon. So, from this carbon, how many carbons directly connected? There are two carbons touching this carbon directly. It means, this carbon degree is 2 degree. Okay. Okay, in the same structure, what about the degree of this carbon? See, it is very simple. If you want to know the degree of any particular carbon, just see how many carbons are directly touching that carbon over. So, what about this carbon? Only this carbon is touching this carbon. This carbon is not touching this carbon. So, this carbon is connected to one carbon directly. That is why this particular carbon is 1 degree. And in same way, this particular carbon is 1 degree, but this carbon is 2 degree carbon. Okay. Let us see more example. Suppose I write CH3, again CH3, CH3, CH2, CH3. Okay. So, tell me what about this carbon? See, this carbon is directly connected to 1 carbon, 2 carbon, 3 and 4. So, this particular carbon is 4 degree carbon or we can call it quaternary carbon. So, what is the degree of this carbon? This is 4 degree carbon. Okay. What about this carbon? This carbon is 2 degree carbon. How? Because this carbon connected with 1 carbon in the left and 1 carbon in the right. So, this is 2 degree carbon. Okay. And remaining all the carbon atoms are 1 degree. I hope you understood because this carbon connected to one carbon only so one degree in same way. Okay. Let us see more examples, no problem. Okay. Suppose this is a compound. Okay. As I told you, or you can know right now, no problem. See this line. If I draw this line, so the starting point is a carbon and end point is a carbon. So how many carbons here? two carbons. Okay. Once again, if I write in this way, try to learn more and more. If I write in this way, starting point is a carbon, end point is a carbon and bending point, this point is also a carbon. So, how many carbons are here? 1, 2, 3, 3 carbons. Okay. Understood? Now, tell me, what is the degree of this particular carbon? This particular carbon degree is 2 because it is connected in left side with one carbon, in right side with one carbon. So, 2 degree it has. This particular carbon degree is 2 degree. It is very simple. Okay. What, tell me, here is carbon, yes or no? Carbon, 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 carbon. So, what about the degree of this particular carbon? See, it is very simple. From here, 1 carbon, 2 carbon and 3 carbon. So, this carbon is 3 degree carbon. What about this carbon? 2 degree because connected to 1 carbon here, 1 carbon here. 2 degree. Understood? This is how we find out the degree of carbon. See some more examples, no problem. 
let us take the example of benzene molecule. This is known as benzene. Okay. See, double bond or triple bond will not affect the degree of carbon. No, not at all. Okay. Degree of carbon only represents how many carbon atoms directly touching to that carbon. That is it, over. So, tell me, at this carbon, you check what is the degree? One carbon connectivity here, one carbon connectivity here, two carbon connectivity. So, this carbon is two degree carbon. See, benzene are two types. One is organic benzene, other is inorganic benzene. This benzene is organic benzene. Okay. All, even all the carbon atoms in the benzene ring, they are two degree or secondary carbon atom only. Okay. There is one more intermediate species like this. This is called benzene. Okay. So, in benzene molecule again, see this carbon connected with one carbon here, one carbon here, two degree. All the carbon in benzene intermediate is again like benzene only and they all are two degree carbon. Dear student, you can see this carbon and this carbon double bonded. Okay. Its degree is two. This carbon and this carbon is triple bonded, still degree is two. I repeat, bonds nature will not change. I mean triple bond or double bond will not affect the degree of carbon actually. I hope you got a good idea of degree of carbon. Let us see some more examples about the degree of carbon. See, you can count here how many 1 degree carbons are present in this particular compound. Just pause the video and tell me how many primary carbons are present in this particular compound. Dear student, you can count that is 1 degree CH3, second one, third, fourth, fifth. So, there are 5 carbons belonging to the 1 degree. So, let me write how many 1 degree carbons? They are 5. Okay. This one, okay. this one, 2, this one, 3 and this one, 4 and this one, 5. So, total 1 degree carbons, they are 5. Okay. Now, question is how many 4 degree carbons total? Total number of 4 degree carbons in this particular compound. It is very simple because I clearly mentioned. So, only 1 4 degree you can check here, this one. Okay. This carbon, only this carbon is 4 degree carbon. Okay. So, 4 degree carbon is 1 only. Okay. Let us go to the next. How many 2 degree carbons in this particular compound? So, there are only 1 2 degree carbon and that is here. This is 2 degree carbon. Can you see that this particular carbon is connected with 1 carbon here and 1 carbon here? See, up and down is hydrogen connectivity. Do not count that. Never ever count that. Never do this mistake. Always check the connectivity of carbon, not hydrogen or any other element. Okay? So, that is why this particular carbon is 2 degree because connected with 2 carbon only. Up and down connectivity is with the hydrogen, not with the carbon. So, do not count that. 2 degree carbon is 1 only. Okay. How many 3 degree carbons? Let us check that. So, in this compound, only one carbon that is 3 degree and it is here. This one is 3 degree. So, only one. In this way, from any particular compound, we can calculate total number of primary carbons or quaternary carbons or secondary carbons or tertiary carbons. I hope you understood the lecture. Thank you.